Welcome ladies and gentlemen. I want to appreciate you so much because of your great support. Please consider subscribing to this channel. Now, William Ruto's statement coming out to confirm that he is a commander in chief. This statement is destroying William Samaruto, including even where he is coming from in Wasingishu County. That statement has not been received well by his villagers because yes he is the president he is the chief in commander he is having powers but the way that he has come out to address the Azmiu team he has come out to intellectualize that he is underrating the Azmiu team as much as William Ruto is so concerned let me remind him that this country is more than you is bigger than you. The way you're coming out to brag day in, day out, the way you came out while you are initially the deputy president, coming out to confirm many times that you are the deputy president of the Republic of Kenya. The same, same rhetoric, you've started it by saying you are the president, you are the commander in chief. So what? The question is, are you comfortable telling even people who are coming from your backyard that you are commander-in-chief. Remember when you're telling them like that, it doesn't change the problem that they are also passing through. It doesn't mean that William Ruto, now confirming to us that he is a commander-in-chief, it means that people from Uwasinigishu County, people from Elgeo Marakwet, people from Nandi County, people from Bomet County are good with this government. I want to confirm to you a simple thing. You saw William Ruto and Rigadi Gashag was saying that fertilizer has been availed at affordable price that a farmer was going to afford. I want to say this. When you look at regions that are serious on farming, includes the backyard where William Ruto is coming from. They've come out many times confirming to us that they have not have an access to that so-called fertilizer that is worth 3,000 Kenya shillings or affordable. What they have said is that this fertilizer is for specific people. And by the way, the fertilizer that these people are telling us that they have come out to subsidize, it is not true. These are the fertilizer that was donated freely by Russia. And these that continue to tell us that they are the one that has come out to make the fertilizer to be at affordable price with the knowledgeable and mind that William Ruto bragged, saying that there are those who made the fertilizer to be so. William Ruto doesn't understand that he is now the president of the Republic of Kenya, not the president of Mount Kenya region, not the president of Rift Valley, not the president of Coastal region. He is the president of the Republic of Kenya. You are the president of opposition. You are the president of the ruling party you are the president of ruling coalition. You are the president of opposition coalition. You are the president of all Kenyans. So when Kenyans have come out to say that they are going to demonstrate, it doesn't mean that Raila Odinga is going to lead a demonstration of Nyanza region. It doesn't mean that Raila Odinga is going to lead a demonstration of Ukambani region. So I want you to watch a video of William Ruto coming out to brag out, saying that he is the commander in chief. So we are waiting whatever is going to happen on Tuesday, despite of him coming to confirm several times that he's going to deal with Azimio. So watch that video. Then you Mimi niliwaambia wiki hiyo ingine. Nikaita ule mzee wa kitendawili. Nikamwambia my brother wewe wacha hii maandamano. Kama hii maneno yako yote hii unasema tupeleke bunge, wabunge waangalie kama kuna maneno ya ukweli. Tunaelewana? Sasa ati wamekataa hiyo ya kwenda kuongea kwa amani kwa bunge ati wanataka kurudi maandamano ati waende wavunje mali ya wananchi ati waende waharibu biashara ya wananchi mimi nataka niwaambie mimi ndio commander in chief nyinyi mtajua hamujui wawache hiyo mchuzi wawache hiyo kuzi siyo kama tunaelewana bwana hakuna mali ya wananchi tena itaharibika hakuna biashara ya wananchi tena itaharibika Serikali ya Kenya itasimama imara. 
kuhakikisha ya kwamba na kulinda maisha na mali na biashara ya kila mwananchi. Hawa so, watu sometimes William Ruto is a man of brags. Just bragging out that now he is the president. I want to confirm to you. Despite you you are the president. It doesn't mean that people in Wasingishu County, Bomet County, Elgeyo Marakwet or in a even part of Mount Kenya region, they are buying unga at different prices the way other regions are buying unga. So when you so or when you listen to Azimio coming out to address the issues of unga, the issues of well, the issues of school fees, the issues of health loan, it is of all kinds. It is not that these are going to benefit only people who are coming from the backyard of Kalonzo Msioka, those who are coming from the backyard of Raila Odinga, but all across the Republic of Kenya. If this mass action is going to affect the economy, is going to affect both Luos, both Kikuyus, Kalenjins, Kambas, and all tribes across the Republic of Kenya. So if William Ruto want to create chaos, when relay with the police, commanding them and giving them a momentum to release excessive force, I want to say they might be happy destroying Azimio, but that they might not understand that they are destabilizing their government on their own. Because Azimio is requesting just simple things. Because I've read a letter of Azimio towards the Mr. Bunge. It's simple. They've come out to illustrate how they're going to demonstrate the reason why they're going to demonstrate, where they're going to start, their destination, and their grievances and their petitions. So if these people have come out to illustrate what and reason why they're going to the street, now they're being told that I'm the commander-in-chief. Then what? What? Yes, you are the commander-in-chief. For what? That is the question that was in Gishu also are coming out to ask. Because when he came out releasing the statement, he thought like, the things are simple and plain like that. That now he has the support because he's coming from uh, Rift Valley. Remember, it is not all of people from Rift Valley are, f are feeling good with the statement of William Ruto. In fact, the statement has come out to expose William Ruto as a man does, that does not have the competence to illustrate that he is the president of all Kenyans. Because many times you can see him coming out bragging out. Remember, even if you are sworn in, not from Rift, even if you are sworn in, it was not Rift Valley and Mount Kenya region or other region only that made it to be the present. Remember, this was also in accordance to the law, despite of what happened, but it was a process of the law. So when you were installed, when you were installed as a president, remember there was a certain law that was followed. So where watch a maneno yakuja na maneno yako yakusema koba that you are the chief commander. And I want to say this video. This video is destroying William seriously. Those who could have come out to trust in William Ruto, they're now exiting. They are not trusting in William Ruto. They don't believe now in William Ruto because. William Ruto is bragging day in, day out. As a president, you are a tool of national unity. Or rather, you are a symbol of national unity. So when you hear the Azimio is going for demonstration, you must be competent to at least review their issues. I want to ask you a simple question. Does this government eligible to solve the issues that Azimio is addressing? Because I've not seen them even coming out to illustrate on how they're going to solve the issues that Raila Odinga is addressing. Raila Odinga, William Ruto does not want to talk about the electoral injustices. He wants the electoral injustices to be like that. That is his opinion. But let me remind him. Remember, that statement that you released in Wasinigishu has started creating chaos in Wasinigishu. Why? The Council of Elders are feeling like you are incompetent of challenges. Your residents are feeling like you are incompetent because even despite you, you are the president, you should not come out to brag and say that you're chief, 
chief uh, in command. Yes, you are chief in commander. Everyone knows, even opposition. So for you to come with that, you are coming out to relay a threat. And this comes after. Moses Kure also came out saying the same, same thing. And even deleting the tweet. So ladies and gentlemen, towards the statement of William Ruto, is there any possibility of him destroying himself? Then drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, thank you so much. Bye-bye.